Okay, so I'll, I'll be brief. Um, we had uh, Peter, Linda, Carly, Karen, myself, Jeff Glazer, and Mohammed. It was a wonderful group, a nice little brains trust. Um, I'll start off with Peter. Uh, firstly, he noticed something which also caught my eye, which were the Greco statues uh, like those. Um, Peter's, I think, if I understand correctly, uh, major takeout from this amongst so many other things was Google Biz, um, Google for Business. Um, I think that that's a really important share. I don't know how many people are aware of that and everyone should be taking advantage of it. <clears throat> Uh, Linda made a very interesting point about, um, you know, we get hit with all these terms and terminologies and software systems and, and everything else, and it can sometimes be a bit overwhelming. So uh, in any environment, you, you know, this is a good example. It's, it's important to somehow, not using the word in a, in a negative co uh, connotation, but to control the noise and really listen out for those nuggets which are applicable to you and to pick out those nuggets and focus on those. I thought that was a really good point. Um, um, then Karen, who's uh, obviously, as we all know, a thought leader and uh, someone who we are all very privileged to have as part of this group, uh, made a very interesting comment and uh, it's one that I really believe and uh, you know it's not always about pace um, you don't just do something because it's the latest newest and everybody's doing it um, Kay mentioned that it's taken her a number of years I won't mention the name because I don't even embarrass you <laughs> Karen um, to get her, her website up and running Obviously, there's a happy medium, um, but on the one side, you have people who do nothing because they're too scared to act. And on the other side, you've got people who are scatter jumping from one solution to another, and both are equally dangerous. So a lot of thought needs to go into these very key decisions. Um, Jeff's comments were very interesting. Um, we're still trying to find out uh, if, if Arvin was involved or not, but that's a story for another day. <laughs> uh, for the group to know, Jeff started off by making a point which, which I often make and I will repeat and reiterate is um, just a thank you to Arvin. Um, you know, what, I, what I've said to Arvin is that I knew his why before he knew it. And uh, in my opinion anyway, it's, it's such an authentic, beautiful why. And, and like Arvin exists to assist others and connect others. And he gets joy in watching other people's businesses grow and thrive and succeed. And that is what underpins the entire new economy. It's what underpins the fourth industrial revolution. So, I just wanted to say thank you to Arvin for, for living your why and for enabling all of this to us. And that was a lot of what Jeff's point was. Um, and uh, the other important thing that Jeff said, which I'll say in one sentence is, it's, it's a bit of a repetition, but it's so true, is make sure that you really pick what's relevant to your business because something can be the bomb for somebody else, but it doesn't suit you. So do the homework, speak to people in your industry and make sure it's right for your business. Um, I've had the, the honor of being, I think it's our third breakout with Mohammed, who always adds lovely value to it. Um, he also mentioned that, uh, um, you know, he took out uh, too many, you know, nuggets to even start listing, <clears throat> many great ideas and concepts and he's looking forward to getting cracking on implementing them in his business. Um, my little uh, close to all of this <clears throat> is, uh, firstly, on a practical note, the App Clubhouse. Thank you very much. I wasn't aware of that. I look forward to looking into it. Um, and then just another point that I made to, to our group is that there, there is that fine line between what people see as 
spruiking yourself in self-promotion as opposed to posting and doing things which are adding value to your network. And we had a, a very uh, thoughtful and intelligent discussion on the difference between the two and how to manage it. So all in all, thank you to everyone in our breakout room. And uh, yeah, it was, it was most enlightening and thank you to Arvin. I'll stop there. <laughs>